How's it going, people? Uh, I'm going to do a little more work on the electric inside today. We got most of the motor wiring wi uh, run. Just got to connect it up. We've got the motor mounted in there. Well, you can't see them very well with my picture, but we had custom axles made for this thing. That was quite pricey. Um, Basically what we did is we took the axle from the BMW system and we had it machined so the Honda bearing would fit on it. So eliminated any having to change the suspension, which, you know, on the back we're going to need stiffer springs because the battery box is really heavy. It probably weighs seven, 800 pounds and it drops the car to the ground. But, so. This is the chassis for the battery box. There's the lower battery down there. It's about 150 volts of the battery. Um, the way we've designed this is there's going to be fans down there that pump outside air in through the ductwork there, which those holes there actually go down into the lower battery box and then they come out right here, which is going to fill this chamber with the, with the main box sitting on top with air and then take all the air out through a hole in the body out to the environment. So the idea is we're gonna move a lot of heat as fast as possible so this thing doesn't overheat and it can actually drive 150 miles on a charge like it's supposed to. But the dash looks bad, I know. I don't have too far to go. I've started to get the pedals mounted and the shifter for the electric car system, which is pretty self-contained. It's gonna run, you know, whether or not the lights on the car work and the ABS and the airbags. But I'm gonna put all that back together so it all works. And then, uh, should have a nice electric car. And hopefully, even though my goals are a little lofty, by Christmas. <laughs> The other thing we did is we, this car was originally designed to plug directly into a 220 system. So, oh shoot, I'll open the gas door. We just went and converted it to J1772, which is the, you know, the electric vehicle charging standard, right? That you find just about everywhere. So I've done a little conversion to the gas tank, the gas cap. Now you can just charge. Custom. The idea of this car is gonna, you know, it's gonna be as factory as possible. Anyway, just thought I'd give a little update. And uh, we're gonna have this thing running by Christmas if it kills me. Have a good day.